So we pick up where we left off last night when Jackie and Shawnee went to Tammy's hotel room. And they knocked on the door and knocked on the door and her big burly ass went to answer the door. So they thought she could have been dead, she could have been missing, or whatever. So, you know, Jackie's scary ass asked for security. But as soon as they asked for security, you know, Tammy got up out, came to the door and was like, what the fuck going on? You know what I'm saying? Jackie was like, bitch, I just called the motherfucking security guards and shit. Like, we thought that something was seriously wrong with you. And Tammy was like, are you serious? And they was like, yeah. She was like, well, give me some time. I'm finna get ready. I'm about to get ready. So, she got ready. She got with the other girls. And everything seemed to be okay for the most part. So, then... <coughs> When it came down to it, they was out on the town in Portugal or whatever, and they were just having a good time. Now, Jackie brought up the fact that, you know what I'm saying, okay, I know that you and Duffy have your issues, but, and I'm looking at the TV like, bitch, why the fuck are you bringing up the issues between Duffy and Tammy? If you really want your trip to be on one and you really want your trip to be about it and you want your trip to be worth something, don't bring up what's very obvious. Stop bringing up the elephant in the room. Pretend like you don't even see them two bitches. You know what I'm saying? It's your trip. Your husband planned the trip. Your husband sent y'all out. Fuck what's going on between two stupid ass bitches. Because for one, I don't like Tammy. But Duffy's stupid as a motherfucker. Because ain't no way I'll be on a motherfucking trip. And I will allow a bitch like Tammy to have me quiet and silent and all of that shit. Fuck what issues I got with a motherfucker. Because at the end of the day, if I got an issue with you, if I don't fuck with you, you're not alive to me. You're dead. You're a ghost. I don't see you. So with that being said, I can still have a good time. Still enjoy myself on a trip with my girls. You know what I'm saying? So, Duff is stupid as hell for allowing Tammy and her issue with Tammy to affect her that much that she can't even enjoy her motherfucking trip. That's the bullshit I'm talking about. So, they go to lunch. And it's pretty clear that the tension is getting to everybody. And it is kind of stupid when you're on a trip and then you got one motherfucking person that's just stuck on drama. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I get it. You don't like Tammy. I get it. You got an issue with Tammy. The shit might be bothering you, but bitch, have a good time because you're ruining everybody else's good time. And I hate it when there's two people with an issue with each other and they ruin everybody else's good time. That shit irks me. And I hate that shit in my real life and I would hate it on that motherfucking reality the show you know what i'm saying so everybody put it out there and you know tammy was you know put it out on the table <laughs> she said you said that you didn't want to whoop my ass in front of my daughter and duffy said and i meant it so that's when tammy said well she's not here my thing about that was tammy why can't you be a 40 year old woman for once like you doing shit that i should be fucking doing even at my age at the age of 27 i shouldn't even be doing that shit and i'm not doing it all that shit that shit right there, I was doing that shit when I was 21. I was doing that shit when I was 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Barely did it at 23. Bitch, grow up. You're, you're like 45 and you still on some bullshit. You still acting like a fucking college freshman. Bitch, get a life. Because everything doesn't revolve around fighting. You can't talk about it like a mature adult because you are a mature adult. Your period is about to stop in a while, bitch. Act like it. You know what I'm saying? Like, bitch, get a grip. And Duffy's sitting up here saying, oh, I'm chilling, I'm chilling. Bitch, you're not chilling. You're not enjoying yourself. Why won't you just say that? But see, you're, you're a weak ass bitch, Duffy. I had so much, so much faith in your ass. And I was rooting for you. I was rooting for you. I have never in my life had to yell at a reality star like this. But you, I was rooting for your ass. And you disappointed me because I'm sitting up here thinking that you're gonna be you're gonna be the one to put Tammy in her place. And in my opinion, your damn finger wave having ass ain't. You just as scary as these other mother other motherfucking bitches is. And I just hate that won't nobody stand up to Tammy like Brandy and Malaysia did. They're the only two that was willing to stand up to Tammy. And even though Tammy played patty cake, patty cake with Evelyn's ass, Evelyn stood up to her motherfucking ass too. Let's just be honest. So whatever. Duffy just really disappointed me on that for real. So after the lunch, you know, Tammy was like, well, I gave her the bitch the floor. She didn't say shit, so it's over with. So then after that, she talks to Shawnee, and she pretty much said, with all the shit that's going on between me and Duffy, this shit really don't matter because I think I'm pregnant. You know what I'm saying? I got all the symptoms of being pregnant. I'm eating like a fucking pig and all of that, and I'm late. Now, if I take a pregnancy test and say that I ain't pregnant, then I'm going to be really worried because it's going to be like, okay, 
I'm menopausal now. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just a fat, hungry, greedy-ass bitch at this point. And I now can't fit my clothes either. Like, that shit don't mix. And I ain't for that shit. You know what I'm saying? And, I, and I'm with you, Tammy. I'm really with y'all, Nick. You know what I'm saying? So, I understand me. So, she don't want the other girls in the motherfucking business. I really believe that the only one out of all those girls that she really, really respects is Malaysia. Because she thinks that Jackie is a damn fool and everybody else does too. And she, I don't really think she cares that much for the angels. You know, she likes them, but you know, those ain't her girls like that. So, you know, it is what it is with that situation. So, they go on the beach and everybody seems to be having fun. But Jackie wants the drinking shit. And in my personal opinion, I ain't saying this in the Bible, and I ain't saying that it's true, and I ain't saying that my motherfucking word, everything I say is the motherfucking truth regarding these bitches. But I personally believe that Jackie wants to sit up here and get these bitches drunk at 10 o'clock in the morning because she wants to eat their pussy. That's what the fuck I believe, because she's so fucking gay to me. Like, this bitch is, a, is like gay as hell to me. All she talks about is titties and, <coughs> and ass. <laughs> and she wants to see motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying, get naked and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like that's 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 that gay shit. And these other girls ain't on. Now she mad as hell because they don't want to drink. They get to the table. Jackie pissed off because they don't want to drink. And so Shawnee was like, "We hear you. We hear you. You're talking about us. We hear you. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you got to say, say it. Just like Malaysia said. Y'all some sour pussy bitches. I'm trying to have a good time in this tension and blah blah blah. Now." Now, was, was what's about to happen? Jackie started this shit because she just couldn't leave well enough alone. She couldn't leave well enough alone. So, she brings it up. You know, Tammy said, well, I feel like this. I gave Duffy the fool and whatever issue she got with me, it really doesn't matter. You know what I'm saying? Now, Duffy wants to sit up here and put her issue out. Why you just didn't say it when you was over there? Now, you saying you were chilling over there, but now you ain't chilling. Now, you saying you had to go home and think about it. Bitch, you just thinking about a fucking issue? So, Tammy don't want to hear it. So, Tammy gets up and walks away. And the next thing you know, Duffy's still yapping her fucking mouth. She's still going on and, on and on and on and on and on and on and on about some shit that don't fucking matter. Why are you talking about it? It's clear that the bitch is walking away and you still run your fucking mouth. Just shut the fuck up if she don't want to talk to you. Let it go. Because it's very mature that this bitch is getting up and walking away. But you keep talking. So next thing you know, Tammy turn around. She walk over there to Duffy. And it was so motherfucking funny because soon as she scooted around that table, everybody hopped up. And the next thing you know, Tammy is on on attack. She mushes brain trying to get at Duffy and everything like that. Then Duffy swings. Now, I give it to all Nick. She did try to swing. But why did Justin swing when that bitch first came at you? Why did you swing then? Like, I just don't think I can give your ass brownie points. For waiting for six fucking security guards to get at that bitch. You could have been got in her ass. You could have been swung at her ass and let it be known that you want that, that you that you was about that life. But you're not. Tell me once again, punking bitches out. And I just don't appreciate that shit. Now you wanna say I ain't scared of no bitch. Well, if you ain't scared of no bitch, swing. Don't wait till six people hold her the fuck down and try to swing on her ass. I get that she's a big burly bitch, but bitch, show that bitch to who the fucking boss is. And you did. And you let me down. This whole fight let me down. But it was fucking entertaining. To be quite honest, it was an entertaining ass scene. I ain't gonna lie to you, it fucking was. But I'm just over Duffy, and I don't give a fuck about Duffy, and I don't care to speak about Duffy anymore because she really pissed me off. I thought she was gonna be one of the ones to join Brandy and Malaysia to put this bitch in her place, and she did. She just did. I'm so disappointed with this bitch. I was rooting for her. Straight up rooting for her. I was rooting for that bitch and she just let me the fuck down. Fuck you, Duffy. Fuck you and your finger waves, bitch. Fuck you. Because you really just let me down. She let me down, y'all. Then Tammy running after her ass like she on the fucking Olympics. I just can't take it. So with that being said, y'all, this is my review on Basketball Wives LA. And I'm out of here, y'all. Till my love and hip hop Hollywood video are out. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. Peace. Duffy, you the ooh, bitch.